You know, they will let white folks make a movie about any goddamn thing. Look at Hollywood. Scissor hands. Give me a fucking break. Somebody is on crack. Somebody's smoking a pipe at the studio. Somebody at the studio is smoking crack. Scissor hands. Throw mama from the train. Only white folks can throw their mama from a damn train. And it's a hit fucking movie. Ain't that some crazy shit? Throw mama from the goddamn... What's the other thing? White men can't jump. They don't have to. They own the team. Some white man is at bank right now. Ooh, my niggas are jumping. Oh, jump, nigga. White daddy make you jump. Jump. Oh, jump. Single white female. They'll let white folks make a movie about any fucking thing. But I knew they were crazy when they let them make Driving Miss Daisy in the 90s. Driving Miss Daisy. Fuck Miss Daisy. I will walk before I drive some goddamn Miss Daisy. Some old Jewish woman, I'll take a bagel and beat the shit out of Miss Daisy. This is the 90s. I'll drive that bitch to an alley and rob her. I will do a carjack. Miss Daisy be on the fucking bus. She fuck with me. See, a lot of you are relating, but a lot of white folks are not laughing. They're holding back because they love that tar baby aunt your mama. Let's go back bullshit. Oh, me dating that little fuck that. I don't like that cooning happy slave bullshit. See, you're white. You can go back. Back to the future. They like all that shit. You can skip on back. Your little ass is white. I go back. I can only go back so far. Then my black ass is in chains. Fuck you. I'm not going back. <laughs> Trying to trick a nigga back. Trying to trick a nigga back. Come on, nigga. Come on back. Come back to Jamaica. Come on. No, I'm going to stay here in the 90s where I can tell you to kiss my black ass. I didn't like the ending of that movie. In the rest home, he's feeding it. Oh, you my best friend. I said, look, poison this bitch so I can go home and get some sleep. <laughs> what they gonna do? Let Spike Lee write and direct part two? <laughs> Driving Miss Daisy some mo. <laughs> um. <laughs> but my favorite, I have to confess, I swear, don't tell anybody, Lassie. I love that fucking Lassie. Was that a smart dog? God damn, that dog was smart. Remember Lassie used to start? That was Lassie whistling. That dog was smart, wasn't it? And then they talked to Lassie like Lassie was a person. You know, they just white folks talk to Lassie like they grew up. Lassie, hey Lassie. Hi girl. How's your mom? Oh, Lassie. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> Call me in an hour, Lassie. I mean, let's talk to fucking Lassie. I saw one, one episode where La Grandpa drove him somewhere, remember? And had a heart attack. Lo Lassie drove him to the hospital. And made a left turn. I said, God damn, Lassie. This is a smart fucking dog. Lassie got dogs killed. I had a little mixed ghetto dog. I must have hit that dog in the head with a hammer. I said, motherfucker, if Lassie can do it, you go do it. <laughs> I said, you better talk back. I'm going to give you to the Vietnamese family. <laughs> I bet they'll make your ass talk. You'll, you'll holler for help. I bet they'll make you talk. <laughs> oh, but that Lassie... <laughs> And then one episode, they got burglarized. They said, oh, girl, what did they take, girl? What? <laughs> Were there any niggas? <laughs> any dark one, girl? Any real dark ones? <laughs> that black girl? <laughs> Make out the police report last year. <laughs> I used to always like put, you know, your race because you're black into movies. I always thought Frankenstein was a nigga. No, because all the white folks were always chasing Frankenstein. Remember? Got him! Got him! He was always running like a nigga. <laughs> and he grunted like niggas. <laughs>
And when he catch him, he's just like, nigga, he'd whoop their ass. <laughs> 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 he started threw motherfuckers all over the place. Rah! I said, get him, nigga. Rah! <laughs> He'd steal shit, remember? <laughs> 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 and then white people were scared of him like they scared of niggas. Oh, what was that? What was that? <laughs> niggas dying? Is it him? <laughs> that shit used to fuck me up. I'm sorry. <laughs> he was trying to catch that nigga, wouldn't he? Crazy wild shit. <laughs> no, that's why I can't get ready for the shit. The movies are crazy. White films, I'm sorry, white folks. It's crazy shit. The one thing in Hollywood, they don't like black men and they don't like white women. You white women here, most, some of you are uncle women, so you know what I'm talking about, but the ones that are up on the shit, you know the game. You watch the movies come out of Hollywood, what they think of white women. They don't give a fuck about a white woman. They put you with freaks. Uh, Beauty and the Beast. Come on, that's bestiality. Uh, a white woman with a fucking monster. I know a monster when I see one. Oh, it's his insides. Fuck that. That's a fucking lion. I have the white lady fucking him all night and shit. Come on. Don't take your kids to see that shit. Four or five years from now, your kid will be in the kitchen fucking the dog singing Beauty and the Beast. Sick shit. King Kong. They ran to get that white woman. Oh, get a white woman. She'll fuck that big gorilla. Get a white woman. <laughs> Princess and the frog. Oh, get a pretty white woman. Get a frog. That's freak shit. And a fucking frog. <laughs> Elephant man. I love you. White lady. Swamp thing. White woman. I love you. <laughs> the, the fly. Big old green eyes. Thorn. <laughs> get a white woman. I love you. Sick shit. That's sick white shit. Put a black woman in these movies and see don't the dialogue change. Put a black lady in the fly. You big-eyed motherfucker. You'll never buzz on this pussy. I bet when I get this black flag, you get the fuck out of my face. Swamp thing, you better get your ass back in them pot of greens. I ain't through cooking them greens. Frog, elephant man, line, get your ass in the car. We're going to the zoo to find you somebody because ain't a goddamn thing happening here. <laughs> but they just give the white woman dumb lines. I love you. They don't give a fuck about the white lady. If they ain't raping the white lady, if it ain't sexual, if they don't have you fucking everything in the movie, uh, uh, then they chopping your head off. White women aren't safe in a dream. If you fall asleep, Freddie gets after your ass. Freddie gets after you. You cannot be safe in the goddamn dream. And then you guys wonder why the serial killer wants you. He goes to the movie, and the movie says, kill the white woman. In fact, kill about 50 of them. That's some cold shit. That's the deal. I just, I, I get a little carried away because fuck it, it, it's real. But that's why I can't watch television because it's too wild. Because they got crazy shit on Star Trek, the new generation. Who's writing this futuristic stuff for black folks? Who's writing this? One nigga's blind, the other one like his motherfucked a turtle. Who's writing this? <laughs> Whoopi Goldberg running around looking like a fugitive from a pancake box. Who's writing this shit? <laughs> <laughs>